Hi guys, how are you doing today? Anyway, my name is Miss Nico. How are you guys doing today? I am doing a review on Kiss Him Not Me. Now, I didn't know what I was expecting when I was getting into this, but basically, uh, is known as Washashi ga Moto Donosa. Maybe I pronounced that wrong. Basically, what it really means is what's the point of me getting popular? It is a Japanese romantic comedy shoujo manga series written and illustrated by Jungle and it's illustrated by Kona Shah since 2013 on the Bisuru Friend magazine. Uh, 12 volumes completing the chapters have been released so far and it's published online in English by Country Row and the box will be, will be published by Konsada USA and it's also an audio drama uh, was released on the first chapter in January of January 13, 2015, and I made adaptation by Brains Base Air Jap Japan in between October and December 2016. The manga has won Best Shoujo Magazine at the 40 Koshada Manga Awards, and I really love this a lot. Uh, the main perk analysis is a very chunky female named Kai Serenuum. And uh, she's very, very lovely, honestly. And she loves shipping male, uh, ca um, not male, well, yes, male characters together, or like watching um, Yali or reading about Yali and love to fantasize and ship between her classmates and stuff like that. And like, I liked her because she is very, very chunky. She's a big girl, and I was like, finally, a big girl that's representing us big girls um but i didn't really like how it all kind of just like seemed like oh yeah she's a big chicken girl oh yeah people treat her like crap because she is a big chicken girl but uh spoiler alert if you guys haven't watched this uh when she loses weight after uh her favorite death her anime character you know, die. She was in mourning, and she rolled up into a blanket burrito. Uh, she's like, "I'm not gonna eat, not gonna do nothing." And when she finally came to her room because of her brother, uh, she becomes attractive. Mean be, meaning as an attractive means she's skinny, and she's attractive, and she becomes the object of obsession f over for like pretty much the whole school. And it's like maybe five, four people in the running to become her boyfriend. Um. She loves otaku hobbies, and she's unsure about the deal with the attention that she gets from the boys, because it's like her first time getting attention from any guy, besides like one guy, which is like really nice to her, and I am rooting for him <laughs> so much. Uh, they're like these boys, and they're like very different, but I'm trying to see, his name is Asuma Mitsusu. I think, yeah, I think that's his name. But he's, like, a bit more laid back, a bit less competitive. But he can be aggressive when someone picks on Kay. He's very open-minded, and doesn't seem to notice or, or, or mind any of Kay's otaku eccentricities. And I'm rooting for him so much. I am rooting for him a lot because he was the only one that knows her before and after she lost weight. He does not treat her any different. He treats her as a human being, and he deals with her very nerdy and a, a, a wild behavior about her otaku. Like, oh, that's awesome. So, that's the one that I'm rooting for. I hope that he wins. I mean, he should win because, like, he's so, he's not, like, a person affected by weight. She can gain weight, she can lose weight, and it doesn't matter to him. Like, he loves her for her, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm just, like, number one in my heart. But um, basically, it's about just a girl in a just day day to day life and having these guys shit out of her and they get to these adventures and they have a great time about it. Um, they need a season two because I need season two. I binge watched this pretty much in a day, you know, not in a twenty four hour day. I'm gonna say maybe in a twelve hour day. I was one after another, one after another, one after another, one after another. That's just like. When I get really obsessed about animes and uh, and I really like it, I will try not to do anything. Like, I will work out, go down there and work out and have my mind focused on that because it is amazing. You guys should, you guys should go ahead and watch it if you guys like that. Um, 
I want to warn you, the first episode is a bit cringy to me, but as soon as you get past that and get involved in the story, I think you guys will like it. So let me know if you guys like his, him, not me, in the comments down below. I know that we probably have some fans. Uh, if you guys like my weird obsession with anime, click the button to subscribe, like, share, and share the video, and comment what anime or manga you guys want me to go ahead and talk about, and I will do it. So, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.